Our token is SETI. The TGE was on March 11th. It's traded on Uniswap, and you can find us paired there against uh, Wrapped Cow. That's the place to go to trade SETI. Look for us on Uniswap or your favorite aggregator. The project is to build globally distributed, high-performance, scalable AI infrastructure, top-notch enterprise, and make it available for decentralized artificial intelligence and deep in projects. And we have found a very strong business case and niche here for being able to bring the same kind of hardware, the same NVIDIA H100 top spec, multi-million dollar server hardware to Web3 that the centralized AI players, the cartel of big companies are able to use on their own. So this is a game changing level of sophistication and enterprise grade capability that SETI AI is bringing to decentralized AI and DeepIn. And I'm proud to say that we lit up our first installation of NVIDIA hardware at our North American data center in Vancouver. And those machines are up and running and they're getting fitted out and tested out right now. And we'll soon be running the SETI AI intelligent compute fabric, which is the software layer that directs our hardware to the decentralized AI projects or the deep end projects that are the most economically productive for us. And I think I've heard at the beginning that something about graphics cards. There are a lot of deep end brokers and projects out there that do aggregate NVIDIA graphics cards for the purposes of providing AI compute, but that is not SETI AI. We don't have graphics cards. We have H100s from NVIDIA, 40 of them with a bunch more on the way very shortly. And we're going to scale this thing globally. And so how does this benefit the token holder? All the revenue that we generate from participating in these decentralized AI networks or deep end networks, 100% of that net revenue is redirected back to the token ecosystem. And so that's the 10,000 foot view. We provide enterprise grade hardware to Web3 AI projects and deep end projects. And the money we make goes back to you, the token holder.